A new film opens tonight in South Austin. Our CW Entertainment reporter Annika Chestnut sits down with the director and one of the stars of The One I Love. Charlie, tell me a little bit about the film's plot for those that don't know. Yeah, well, we have uh, we have a kind of reveal early on in the movie, so we keep a lot of it secret and close to close to our chest. But the the kind of setup premise is it's about a couple who's a couple who's struggling in their marriage, and they uh, are sent to this retreat house by their therapist to work on their relationship. And when they get there, something happens that just kind of changes everything, and a kind of bomb is dropped in the middle. So, do you think audience members will? Uh, be shocked by the mysterious plot when they figure out what it is? No, it's less about the shock and, and more about the fun surprise. I mean, uh, when you first start dating someone, you sort of present this version of yourself that's um, a little more shiny and a little more polished, a little nicer and um, maybe more forgiving and sensitive than you really are. Then that shine comes off and you're left with the reality of who you are and, and who your mate really is. And, and what do you do to deal with that disparity? Um, so while the movie does have these sort of crazy sci-fi plotting elements and these fun, otherworldly things, things happening at the core it is still a relationship kind of uh, comedy drama about a couple trying to figure out you know um, should they stay together or is it too much work and should they split up how did you prepare for the role when we started talking about this movie we started talking a lot about like how how different we are with different people you know you'll be at a party and you'll find yourself talking to someone and then you turn around and then you'll be acting kind of differently to the next person you talk to um, and that fascinated us that little element of almost a sociopath in all of us and so for me in this movie I, I have to play like you know uh, congenial and sweet uh, and sensitive and then at times play a little jealous and a little anxious and nervous and then at times play angry and, and downright vindictive and evil um, and, and so is a whole spectrum of stuff going on for me and for Elizabeth Moss. The One I Love opens today at the Alamo Draft House on South Lamar. You know, that theater itself just reopened three weeks ago.